Good morning. Welcome to New Life. What a joy to have you join us for our morning worship. I am Bernicia Graham and I have your news for this Sunday, June 26th. Congratulations to Mary Marshall, who is a great grandmother, as well as Cedric and Latasia, who are the parents of Cedric Damar Washington. Deacons, the next virtual deacons meeting will be July 9th at 9 a.m. The Deacons of Annex 1 will be hosting the meeting. Deacon Avant is asking all deacons dial in as deacon board updates will be discussed as well as updates on the status of plans and ongoing work for all of our locations. Youth Bible Study is every first and third Tuesday night and Youth Choir Rehearsal is every second and fourth Tuesday night at Annex 2 in the cafeteria. Both start at 7 p.m and will end at the conclusion of Tuesday Night Bible Study. Don't forget to sign up for the Junior Deacons Program. There are forms located in the lobbies of each location and on our church app for sign up. Join us for in-person Bible study on Tuesday nights beginning at 7 p.m. Remember to log in to our co-pastor-led Bible study on Thursday nights beginning at 7 p.m. Don't forget about Virtual Sunday School on Saturday nights, beginning at 7 p.m. We have several different ways to pay your tithes and offerings, whether in person or virtually. You can give in person during service, online through our website, or you can use Cash App from your mobile device. You can also mail it to the church office. Let's continue staying safe and keeping one another lifted up in prayer. Please be in prayer for Mother Clara Smith as she lost her sister, Rosemary Burdett, on Tuesday, June 21st. Memorial services were held on yesterday in Minneapolis, Minnesota. Please be in prayer for Wanda Knight as she lost her mother-in-law, Lula Lee Knight. Homegoing services will be held at 11 a.m. on this Saturday at Emmanuel Faith Christian Center in Atmore, Alabama. Please be in prayer for Eric and Rhonda Brown and the Myrick and Harris families as she lost her uncle, Reverend Benny Myrick, on Wednesday morning. He was a New Life Extended member. Homegoing services will be held on Tuesday at the Ross and Clayton Funeral Home Chapel beginning at 1 p.m. Pastor Ellison will be officiating. And our scripture for the week comes from Romans 12 and 12. Rejoice in our confident hope, be patient in trouble, and keep on praying. Now, let's get back to our worship. 